Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to some more Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Last time we did some fairly long challenges. I guess we did one long challenge. I don't know how long the other one was compared to it. But anyway, this time we're going to do another challenge. Fairy Fountain, Grassy Plains, and hopefully we'll get some more materials we need for other things. So here we go. Going to go in with uh, Imper again. I didn't really think to change my character, but I think this is fine as it is, so. Hitting water or metallic objects with an electrified attack causes a powerful discharge of electricity, shocking affected enemies. That's interesting to know. I have to keep that in mind. There's a lot of things that you don't really think about. Attack uh, wreathed in fire, capable of setting the surroundings alight. Grassy areas are especially vulnerable. So it seems like each of the elements have certain areas that you can do it and it'll be more effective. Long loading screen, wow. Very long. Here we go. Here I am, come this way. Okay then. If you say so. Head for the targeted position. I just do this. There we go. And now let's just go absolutely crazy on everything. Oh, hello, Moblin. I didn't see you there. And I won't see you there in a second here. Let's use our special. We've got a full thing, so. There we go. Kaboom. There we go. More symbol. More symbol. Oh, there's more. Hello, friends. How about we switch targets and we use our special? If we can. Hello. There we go. Just getting absolutely destroyed in the middle there. Goodbye. Oh, come on. Can we target one? Thank you. Damage, 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 damage. Let's also heal. Oh, and I actually did something useful. Cool. We point smash. Now if I can focus on this fire moblin. Let's go ahead and freeze him. And let's take him out. We point smash. There we go. We're going to get some more element back probably. Just a little bit. This gate should open. Gather the rupees? Where? Oh, it's on the outside of the gate, isn't it? No, it's over this way. Ah, I see where I made my mistake. That's fine. Attacks are probably way faster than an opening chest. It's time, move out. Let's go this way. Head for the target position. Five minutes to do so. Pro should hurry. I think it's over this way. The gate is closed. Defeat the Hinox. Okay. There he is. Oh my goodness. Hello. Oh my goodness. Let me... Oh wow. That was really useful that these chews are here. Because they just explode and it stuns things because it's electricity. Ow. Let's go ahead and use ice. Oh, there's also a ride thing. I don't know how to do that. Oh well. Let's use a special. While well, it's still at full strength. Okay, there we go. Can we use Kronos? Thank you. Oh, wow. Weak point smash again. 
There we go. Treasures have been discovered. Let's go pick them up. Just like that, and that, and that. Okay, now. Is it... Where is it? Oh, it's this way. Okay. I'm over here. This way. There's no time limit, so I'm just going to take a second here to absorb some symbols. Please? Maybe? I'm not sure if I'm doing it correctly. Ow. Okay, I'm just going to run like this. After all, we have a great fairy to fight again. Okay, let's do that. I am the Great Fairy Kotera. I ask that you show me what you're made of. Okay then. If you say so, that's the weakness. Fire. Weak point smash. Let's use fire again. Weak point smash. Patera has been defeated. May this victory be a May this victory carve a path to a better tomorrow. Hopefully. That went really well, fighting that great fairy. A lot better than last time. It took me way longer with the previous one. But anyway, there we go, some more things. And I might actually need to use the forge, otherwise I'm probably going to be throwing out items or weapons. That's the one. Gonna spend all my rupees on it. Or I could sell some that I don't actually need. That's also a possibility, but I doubt that any of the things that I've been actually, any of the weapons I've been getting recently aren't that good, so. They're probably fairly good. Fuse weapons. Do I wanna give Link more power? Probably. I would, I would like. Is that a different type of weapon? No, it's not, okay. And I'm probably not gonna use the other ones, but I might as well keep them. Um, let's just fuse the things into the Master Sword. Although, how about we do something else? Where? I do that. Okay, makes sense. And then, I select the Claymore, and I put the Hammer, the Boat Oar, um, the double, and the Double Axe in that. <laughs> there we go. And then, I select the... Oh, do I want the Knight's Halberd? Or the Soldier's Spear? I might use the... Ho I might just keep the spear as the main... The style that it looks. Okay. <laughs> just like that, okay. Now, what else have we got to do? We can do a few things here. do that. <laughs> Just fuse literally everything in existence into this. <laughs> literally everything. <laughs> Very nice. Level 12. Almost 50 damage. Almost 50 attack. Also, we have... Is this different? I don't know. It's a little bit different. Like, Sheikah Slate things, but anyway. Let's just select it, and then let's fuse everything into it. <laughs> My rupees are slowly depleting again, but that's alright. I might actually sell that one that's level 1 with 9, a nine <laughs> attack. Maybe, or not. There we go. Level 15 with 47 attack. Mifa, let's just... Just two spears, wow. That's a lot less than everything else that we've seen so far. Probably need to use Mifa a little bit more. Hester, let's you give you more maracas into your maracas. 
<laughs> there we go. It's not the strongest weapons I've seen so far. And I'm probably going to keep the Scimitar of the Seven for Arbosa. And just level that up. A little bit. Ravali, you probably want to keep the Great Eagle Bow. Is this actually helping? A little bit, maybe. Okay, let's have a look at the thing when I do it. So it goes from 38 to 45. Oh my goodness. Plus mid-air attack damage, plus 5%. Okay. It seems to be every time it levels up. Also, this is only level 10 out of 20. That means 20 is the max level, which is very concerning. Because that means... I don't even know. How far into the game am I? I don't know. Let's polish a sword for a bosa. See, let's put in a few rub rubies into it. And a few more sapphires. I, I don't think I need them yet. And let's see. What do I want to put into them? I can't do those because I need those. And they're surprisingly lot low numbers considering they're just dropped by the regular enemies. Which is concerning. Oh my goodness, I have to really think about this. I could do some of these cobbling guts. Or I could do some moblin horn. Let me do a few moblin horn. Like 16, and the rest can be... Or well, 10 of those can be the guts, and then the rest can be... Whatever that was, moblin fang. Okay. And now these. The Coblin Trophy, I hope it's not what I need, but it's... there's so many of it, so I might as well. Or well, maybe I'll do 50 and 50. How much of other things do I have? Not a lot. This was just the most I have, so let's just do the full thing. Confirm. Let's see what we get. We get Moonlight Scimitar, 31 attack. Probably confuse that into the other weapon, probably. I don't know if I, I still don't know if I'm doing the forge correctly. Did that? What did that do? Did that increase attack? No. Okay, just just as a, a theory, what happens if I do 45 versus 38? So it seems to be wanting me to actually change which weapon I use, but I like the way this weapon looks. So I'm very. I just I don't know if I'm using the forge correctly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> anyway, let me just do that, just because it's not really going to stop me from winning the game if I do that, so, anyway, it's Shaka, Shaka, Shakala time. You hear that, Hestu? The magician of Korok Forest wants to play a recital for all his siblings. Bring me lots of Korok seeds so I can shake my maracas, Shaka, Shakala. Nine Korok seeds and a whole lot of other things. With plenty of seeds to fill his maracas, Hestu played a lively rhythm that got everybody in Korok Forest dancing. The great Deku tree watched in silence as the uh, revelers pranced about. Hestu special attack gauge plus one. And I think there's nothing else we can do just to get regular monster parts, so. We're just going to be doing regular battles, probably, and challenges. Coliseum Beginner. Okay, then let's switch character to probably Zelda again. Yep. And let's... Oh, I'd recommend level 30. How about we go to the... What's it call it thing? The military training camp and get you up a little bit. Probably get everyone up a little bit to 30. Mifa, Hestu, uh, Daruk, and that's everyone at level 30. Not too far behind Link. Let's go do this. And hopefully I won't have too much trouble. Hopefully. I'm probably going to have a lot of trouble. Just guessing that it's a Colosseum area thing.
highly remote bombs are highly effective against defensive enemies. Use the blast uh, from this room to overcome an enemy's guard. Let's get started. That was a fast loading time. Defeat all enemies before time runs out, and it's in a thing. Okay then. Ow. Oh, that didn't work. Come on. Oh my goodness, I cancel out of it every time. Can I please... Do that? Oh my goodness. Okay, I was hoping that was going to actually help me get onto it. Because I think that's how the game's been telling me that I could ride things. Oh my goodness. That's a new thing. Ow. Can I do anything that's going to be effective against this? I don't know. I can throw up at this thing. Okay. Oh, ride. Where's its thing? There. Oh, please, 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 please. Nope. I'm off. Let's use bombs again. Which point smash? There we go. Probably should have waited a little bit longer before doing that. Oh, wonderful. Ow. Oh, it's so close now. Oh, it's about done. What's next? Oh, there's another enemy. According to the mission thing. A Hinox. Okay. Hello. That didn't quite work the way I hoped, but that's fine. We can probably also strike you with lightning. Come on, weak point smash. Okay, let's try bombs again. No, that didn't help. That's fine. Oh, fly rush, thank you. Very nice. That was so good. Oh my goodness. Let's do that. Okay. This is very close to weak point smash. There we go. I don't think that's going to be it, but maybe. Nope. Okay, then. That's fine. Let's just figure out what I'm doing. Okay. Let's use stasis, apparently. Didn't mean to do that, but that's fine. Oh, dodge. Nope. Oh, that's stasis. Oh, my goodness. Half the time limit remains. Well, that's fine, because this is almost done. Ow. Do that. Come on, there we go. All enemies have been defeated. Well done, our victory is certain. Colosseum beginner, victory. Probably means there's going to be more Colosseums. There we go. More materials. Very nice. I wonder if it's actually going to open up another challenge, like, immediately after that. It might, or it might not. Let's find out. It might not, okay then. So I think there's only one... Two, three, four, five challenges left? Oh, six. Okay. 
So we're going to be here a little bit longer. But anyway, that is it for this episode of Hire Warriors Age of Calamity. So thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys next time.